What is your best, they can't send us all to detention story? In 11th grade, my gym teacher had the high school change uniform rule so that none of the girls past grade 10 could wear shorts at all during PE. No matter the length, it wouldn't have been so frustrating if the teacher herself hadn't worn booty shorts and was never told to cover it up because she was leading the Mary principal around by his dong. So all of us in my grade that had gym wore pants the next day, but refused to do anything except sit on the floor the entire period the principal was called and threatened us all within school suspension. But we kept sitting and ignored him. We repeated it for two more days before they let us wear shorts again. Another teacher had to call the school board, and the school board was like, just let them wear shorts. It's P.E., it's lame, but it's all I got, sorry, too. When I was in junior high school, probably about 1968 to 1970, female students were not allowed to wear jeans or pants of any type, skirts and dresses only. And this was public school. If you did try to wear pants, you would be sent home to change. One day, a large group of us decided to all wear pants and just see what happened. About 60 girls all wore slacks. Not even jeans, but nice slacks to class. And they made us sit in the hallway until they figured out what to do. We had to sit in the school auditorium all day. But the whole thing started to dialogue with the school district. And the next year, we could wear pants to class. A year after that, we could wear jeans. Story 3, when I was in high school, a student walked up to the front of the class and pulled the clock off a wall and wound it forward one minute past when the bell typically would ring. The entire class watched him doing this and actively began distracting the teacher so she wouldn't notice. He goes back to his seat calmly and raises his hand. Excuse me, Miss Spanish teacher. Yes, can we go now? I think I heard the bell. Oh my goodness, everyone go. The entire class sprinted out the door and started, booking it down the hallways and into the parking lot. The assistant principal took over the class for the rest of the week.